Hello guys and welcome to TechBased. In this video, we're going to talk about what you can do in case explorer.exe is not starting with Windows 10. So as you can see in this case, I just uh, started Windows 10 and this is a black screen. Uh, Windows Explorer is not opened. So for those of you who don't know what Windows Explorer means, Windows Explorer or explorer.exe is basically your taskbar, your user interface after all. So what you can do in this case, a temporary fix would be to to uh, press control plus shift plus escape on your keyboard and this will open up task manager and here you can go and click on file and run new task type in explorer.exe and then press enter and as you can see explorer.exe is opened up but this is a, only a temporary fix because maybe when you restart your operating system you would still not get your explorer.exe automatically opened so in this video i'm going to show you how to fix that just go into the search bar and type in here reject it right click on registry editor and run as administrator on user account control just click on yes and now what you have to do locate h key current user expand it then locate software then go down a bit where it says microsoft expand it then go down a bit to windows nt expand it expand current version and the last thing that you can see here is when logon make sure to click on that to open up all the registries that are in that file now if you have this problem and windows explorer is not opening up automatically when you open up your operating system here in this list you're gonna see a registry which will be called shell it will look something like this i just created it for testing purposes but you will have it here and if you double click on it you'll see that it will have a value of percentage comspec percentage but that doesn't matter just go and cancel this and delete the shell registry right click and delete then click on yes and of course after that just exit out of here restart your operating system and you should be good to go so i'm hoping that this video helped you and you managed to fix the problem and now when you start windows windows explorer automatically starts as well if this video was useful don't forget to leave a like down below and also subscribe to the channel with the notification bell activated so you won't miss any future uploads like this one i was emmanuel from tech based until next time have a nice day